Hello everybody and welcome to Romanceville's Tarot. I'm about to begin here with a reading. Now this is a general reading so it might not resonate with everybody. It really is important that you please do take whatever does resonate with you um, and just you know leave the rest aside. If you do have any questions you would like to contact me please do so. You can find all of my information, list of readings, contact, everything is right below here into the YouTube description box. Please do check it out and please do not hesitate to contact me. It will be my great pleasure to assist you. Also, if you have not yet subscribed to the channel, please do take a brief moment of your time to click onto the subscribe button to show your support to the channel and to myself and it is always and greatly appreciated. That being said, I would like to thank every single one of my subscribers. I value all of you and I thank you for being there. I would also like to thank all of the subscribers who have so generously donated to the channel. I do uh, truly appreciate it and I am very grateful. So with no further ado, these are angelic messages for you. I have four. Take what's good. Leave the rest. I'm going to conclude with some power of love. So I'm going to conclude with a little activation card. So let's start by turning these over. We're going to begin here with faith and values. We have forgiveness. We have hidden treasures. And we have some intentions. So let's start this off over here with faith and values. How? This is about your values. They are guiding principles. Use them to choose the way that you live your life. Now your personal core values, they define who you are. Your character paves the road to your destiny. A value may be defined as something that we hold quite, quite dear to us and those qualities that we consider to be, to be of worth. Your personal values, they, they're like fingerprints. Nobody are the same than you. But you need to leave them all over everything that you do and what you say because values, they are an internal guide to do what is right and what is virtuous, to embody the characteristics of integrity, of loyalty, of honesty. So right now, the angels want you to take time in your own personal development to identify your values and then commit to them, as it is easy to lose faith and to be influenced against your own judgment. Your angel message here is to love and to care for others, to lead by example, but by living your values. Moving on forward to your following message I have over here, forgiveness. Forgiveness goes kind of both ways, eh? not kind of, it does. A forgiveness of yourself, forgiveness of others. Let's go and see. Forgiveness is a first step towards letting go of hurt and emotional pain. It heals only you. That being said, it's so easy to say that you need to forgive that person who has hurt you or who has wronged you. In truth, this is simply not an easy thing to do. It takes time, meditation, prayers to let go of all that bitterness, of all that pain that we hold on to for so long that just becomes so burdensome. When you forgive, you have to go deep within yourself and within your soul to let it go. The release is also going to manifest in your physical body and it's going to reduce the pain. It's going to reduce the anxiety. Now, forgiveness, it gives you that healing peace and empowers you to live the gift of life that has been bestowed upon you. Now, many people allow their pain to kind of just cripple them, leaving them stuck and unable to enjoy life. You need to let it go for your own sake. The angel message you must remember here is about reaping the benefits of forgiveness and it's about setting yourself free and simply becoming healed. Moving on over now to some beautiful hidden treasures. The hidden treasures. Bring your creative ideas and your hidden talents to life. Present your gifts to the world. So you have your own, your very own treasures that are hidden right there within you. Of those unrealized skills or creative ideas that need to be brought to life. And there is something brewing inside of you. And it is so important to see yourself as your own masterpiece. It's not just your talents, education, or your family foundation that propels you to, to great heights or limit even your progress. 
The angels that you are unwavering force and that you are always working behind the scenes to bring you those opportunities to create the you that you were simply born to be. Now, your angel message here, very important with the hidden treasures, is that the angels right now, they're encouraging you. They're encouraging you to reach your highest potential and to see yourself but succeeding into the world. You have to believe in yourself. You have to have that faith and you have to start making those paths, those, those movements forward. We're going to finish this off over here with a little bit of intentions. Our intentions over here is about intention is that creative, uh, that creative power that just fulfills your dreams. As your will, so is your beautiful destiny. So when you have an intention, you call forth the awareness of the heavenly host. Therefore, having that divine intelligence working for you, open yourself up to a higher awareness where faith powers the entire process. Intention plays a crucial role in your spiritual path. It is your innate desire, something that comes from the from deep within your heart, where there's faith and your faith is going to deliver to you your outcome. You are the manifestation of your deepest desire and as your intention is, so is going to be your will. As your will is, so is going to be your deed. And as your deed is, so it's going to become your destiny. Maintain optimism through the process as divinely inspired gifts are arriving all of the time. You need to take time in meditation and in prayer to set your heartfelt intentions. Moving on forward now to your activation card. We have over here the past. And the past is about through the power of love, you release any stagnant situations or energy in order to transform your heart space. The past, it's done. The future, well, it's yet to be. And you have it. And all you have right now is the now. And the past, it's your greatest teacher. Everything that has happened up until this very moment is the product of the person that you see when you look into the mirror. And that is why the power of the now is so very important. Only in the present do you have the opportunity to create both your past and your future. Always be mindful of your present moment thoughts because in seconds, now is going to become your past, which cannot, you cannot get that back. And you do not want the past to steal your future. And the bridge between the two, it's the present. So begin to live into the present time and always remember that through loving, through compassionate thoughts and actions, you are creating a past that you can be proud of and a bright future that's going to await you. And this does conclude this reading. I do hope that you enjoyed. I do hope that the angels brought you some very interesting messages that you will be able to use. If you have any questions you would like to um, contact me, please do so. All of my information is right below into the YouTube description box. If you have not yet subscribed, please do so. And I will be seeing you tomorrow with new messages. Many blessings to you.